Some experts are currently attempting to predict which jobs are most likely to be automated based on measures like their repetitiveness and complexity. Based on these measures, we can see what types of AI technology will be necessary to automate a variety of occupational tasks. For example, we can see which retail jobs will likely be automated in the coming years as AI continues to be applied to retail sales. Even the medical industry isn't immune to this coming wave of automation. While these medical tasks are generally more complex and less repetitive than most jobs, they're rapidly becoming within the reach of modern AI. We can then extrapolate this information to determine which sectors of our economy will be hit the hardest by AI automation. The length of the bars in this chart represent the total number of workers in each type of employment in the USA as of 2016. The red bar segments represent the proportion of jobs at risk of automation in the next two decades, while the blue bar segments represent the proportion of jobs that are not at risk of automation in the next two decades. As we can see, the future landscape of labor in the next few decades is likely going to look radically different than it currently does today. In fact, we can even use these data to predict which cities will be most impacted by unemployment from AI automation. As we can see, Las Vegas, Nevada, where I live, is currently at the top of the list. In fact, it's predicted that 65% of all jobs in Las Vegas are at risk of automation by 2035, and roughly half of all jobs in the United States are at risk of automation in the next two decades. There are certainly jobs that will be more resistant to automation. These jobs require more human aspects like compassion, creativity, empathy, and trust. However, there are many jobs today that are unlikely to exist in the next few decades. This will create a tremendous disruption to our labor economy with unemployment, retraining, and early retirement. On the other hand, it will create tremendous opportunities for new jobs that don't yet exist and for the IT professionals that build these automation systems. To learn more, please click the link in the description. For more content like this, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe.